Well, good morning. Good Sunday morning to you. Good coffee. Black, of course. Got my maple caramel macchiato. Great flavored coffee. I don't drink, um, normally drink flavored coffees, but when I do, it's maple caramel macchiato. Um, no, it's actually a pretty good one. The coffee place uh, that I go to, the gentleman introduced me to it there. And uh, I like it. Normally, I just drink Dolgers or regular coffee, whatever it happens to be. Um, but this is actually pretty good. No sugar, no cream, just black. And uh, it's good stuff. But I enjoy my coffees. Now's the time of year when I start drinking more coffee. The colder weather, it's funny how things go in a season. Um, with the seasons, you change what you do. Um, so as it gets colder, I drink more coffee. And in the wintertime, I'm drinking coffee pretty much all day long. So I'll need to stock up. But that's how I roll. But uh, it's been raining here. It rained all last week, this past week. Uh, nothing like what the poor folks down south are getting with the hurricane. And I guess Tennessee got slammed. It's got flooding North Carolina. Florida just devastated. So keep those folks in your prayers. My little dog's over there all happy rolling around on the chair. Scratching herself with the chair fabric, I guess. She gets happy and that's her I'm I'm in a happy mood type thing. But anyhow, keep those folks that were affected by this hurricane in your prayers because they they just lots of de devastation and for the lives lost. Pray for those families. And uh, and if you can support and do something good for them down there, do it. If you can donate some money, do it. If you can donate some food, clothing, whatever, do it. Uh, not that I'm panning for any one organization. I know we've done that in the past. So the missus and I, we went to church this morning. Church for us is early morning. We go to a small little country church. And uh, we like it. We like the people there. A lot of farmers. And uh, starts at 8.45. Uh, that's even better. So we like that. Very nice country church. Good, good preaching from the pulpit. Good people. And uh, salt of the earth type of people. I mean, these are the farmers. Most, most of the people there, I think, have something to do with farming in one way or another. And uh, I like being around those people. Our farmers, I think, don't get enough credit and enough respect for what they do for us, to feed us, um, and for what they do for the, the uh, agriculture world and for the environment and stuff. So. That is some good stuff. So as I said, it's been raining all week. Grass is really high. I've got mushrooms blooming around my yard. Um, it's going to be a two-cut week this week. If we get out of this rain, I'll have to cut it at a certain depth, a higher depth. And then I'll have to go down to the depth that I want it. So, kind of. All this rain kind of puts me back on some of the chores that need to get done before winter. I got some pretty pretty high, they're like 12, 15 foot high hedges. And they're starting to fall and bend over. So I gotta get them trimmed off because 
if we get a heavy snow this year, those branches are going to break and then it's going to be ruined. Now she's the neighbors going by. She likes to bark when they beep. But anyhow, if we get a heavy snow, then they're breaking. And it kind of separates us. It's like a dividing from our neighbor behind us. It gives us privacy. Uh, and I don't want to lose that, but I got to trim them back. I got to get the, the garden ready for the winter. I've got some other projects outdoors that got to get done. So this rain, this rain's kind of putting me back a few weeks. But the upside of that is we needed the rain. We needed the rain. We needed it. It's not been like a hard rain and then stops. It's been a steady drizzling, some downpours um, type of rain. Now it's like a misting right now. So it's good. It's good for us. Our farmers needed it. Uh, they really needed it. So uh, I'm glad. But the grass is high and lush and green. And it's going to be a bear to cut. So that's why I'm going to cut it in layers. Because um, if I don't, I'll just have all this grass laying in my yard. And I don't want to run that through twice. When I can just cut layers. So, other than that, not a whole lot going on. Works good. Family's good. I got two grandchildren coming up here this winter. Two brand new grandchildren. One's due around Christmas and the other one's due around New Year's. So we're excited about that. Family's growing, getting bigger. It's a blessing. You raise your kids and then you start seeing them growing their families. And it's just, it's like you think, where did the time go? But we're doing, we're doing well. We're doing well. Family's doing really well. And we're uh, moving right along. Hopefully, my truck has been in the shop getting refurbished or rehabbed or whatever you want to call it. For almost a year now. And I am hoping that he is soon done because I really like to get my truck back. I got a ton of brush that's got to go down to the brush pile down at the township so they can make mulch. I mean, I've got a lot and I've got to get rid of it. So it's going to make like three or four, maybe five trips just to get that stuff down there. Anyhow, hope you all have a good relaxing Sunday. It's a resting day for me. Back to the grind tomorrow. We'll see how it goes. Enjoy your coffee today. Light them up.